Welcome to the video today guys. It's all about duct tape. Hopefully you enjoy it. Let's go. So sorry, I, does duct tape work more than once? I'm gonna go make a, I'm gonna go make a survival vlog. And if you wanna come with me, you may. So is this thing working? Yes it is. So we have spent ten days in the wilderness, five of them without food, but luckily Mystery Man and I found food on the sixth day. And what I mean by Mystery Man, he was the one with the duct tape. Right there, that's him with the duct tape. And that's another abandoned building behind us. I, we're in an abandoned town. There's no food, no water. But we found a helicopter crate that dropped, but we used all the food from that. So, hey, wait, who are you? I'm just a man passing. Talk, where did you get that bottle? From a gas station 50 miles up the road. Okay, uh, how did you get here? I walked. How long did it take you? About five days. Five days? You mean you're telling me you had cheeseburger ribs in that five day when we were starving? Yeah. We're gonna tell you up to a tree. What are you doing here? <laughs> I mean, okay, we're telling you up to the tree because you snuck into our camp and walked 50 miles and didn't bring us any food. I'm happy to walk back. No. But I got this duct tape. Now that we got here. this duct tape from my friend here. Oh, we need more duct tape, don't we? Yes, we do. Okay. You gotta make sure it's tight or I'm gonna get out of this thing. No, you're not, because duct tape is invincible! <laughs> Ow! It's pulling up my hair. Okay, so. <laughs> I don't like this. Tell us your name. Brodozer. Brodozer, what YouTube channel? <laughs> Ultimately Epics. Okay. I've never heard of it before, but I think I might subscribe as soon as we get back into civilization. Okay, tell us, where is the nearest gas station? 50 miles up. Is it a Texaco? Right. Yes. Okay. Do they have oil? No. I used it all trying <laughs> to fuel up my car. What car do you have? A, Ferrar a Ferrari. You don't have a... Yeah, okay. Okay. So we have Mr. Rich Boy here that apparently doesn't know how to take care of himself. And he uses all the oil. So Ow! we're gonna leave him here probably for a let's see. Ten days and if he be if <laughs> Hey, you better not escape. I'm taking my bottle with me. Sure. So I have everything in here. Um, so follow me back here. I want to show you my tractor. Um, super nice. I restored it myself. Put a brand new motor in it. Super nice. I need money. 
I want a million dollars for it. You're rich, aren't you? Yeah. What do I get out of it, though? Texas Roadhouse. I need. I'm gonna need more. Oh yeah, yeah. How about this? If you give me a million dollars for the tractor, and I'm out of that million, I'll buy you Texas Roadhouse whenever you want. All right. Not every day though, but like maybe like once a week. So that's 56 right. times. I mean, that's your average true. person goes to Texas Roadhouse once a month. I mean, once, once a year or whatever. Whenever they want fancy rolls. Yeah. But, you know, I want to show you something out here. I have it on the door. But, that's for burglars. Yeah. That's really new. Duct tape. Oh, duct tape. There we go. Do we okay. need to duct tape the door shut? No, why would we do that? You're to, crazy. To make sure that the duct tape doesn't fail us. You're not. You're smart, but you're not rich. Let's go get Texas Roadhouse. Uh, okay, um, so I'm sorry to tell you, but this guy's broken into my house, so we're going to go... Can take his shoes? No, we're not his taking hat. his shoes. Don't take his hat, you meanie. Thank you, bro-dozer. Thank you for the stereotypes. It's watching those was kind of a teaser for the video. But we are going to be building a plate and a cup with duct tape. And we're going to time lapse most of the build, and I'm going to do inner inner segments when we're building. So let's go, and we're going to start off with the time lapse. So we're going to start off with plates, and this is all we can make plates out of. So we're going to get to it. Hey, so I am still working on my plate. It is here, that thing, and he has finished his plate that and mystery man is still working on his plate so we're going to resume time lapse let's go okay so okay the technically the first place winner right now not really first place winner man because bro dozer took his apart and he f built that i'm still building it and i'm still building mine it's a very uh, foldable way, really nice easy plate, and we are going to continue to hyperlapse. Okay, so we finished all our plates, bro dozer time's up, put the tape down. No! Okay, so mystery man, I'm not camera. So basically we have the plates here. There's mine, it's nice kind of sturdy. There's bro dozers. There's mystery man's, it's really cool. We're gonna do that, whoa. Like a <laughs> okay, so we are going to go, we're moving on. We are moving on to cups. Hey, so we are gonna move on to the cups. Bro Dozer doesn't know how to sing. But we're going to move on to the cups and we're going to time lapse the whole thing. Let's go. The cups didn't go that well. Bro Dozer attempted to just wrap a plastic water bottle over in duct tape. He failed. When we failed cups at all. So, and Mystery Man's going to break a tree. We're playing a game called Duck Ball. Uh, CG has a duck ball. And if you get hit twice, you're out. And if you catch it, the other person is out. So it's just like dodgeball, except you can get hit twice. The second time you get hit, you're out. But let's start.
still the one and only Mystery Man 1. And just like that, we are on to round two to see who the new champion will be.